this was the artist concept and you can see that this shows the orange just moving you know orange moving into the red right yeah so we have dark orange here moving over to light orange to light red and then starting to move over into the dark red and each panel will have a silhouette of a plant form from Burbank Gardens painted on it, um, which we thought was an excellent way of bringing Luther Burbank into the mural without it actually being a picture of Luther Burbank himself, which so many of the murals in Santa Rosa that have to do with Burbank always picture him. But in this case, he's doing all the plant forms rather than Burbank himself. So there's um, between 25 and 30 silhouettes of plant forms that would be, um, you know, on, that would be repeated right. on the mural. Okay. Then, if that wasn't enough, there'll be silhouettes. You can see he's put a six foot tall man here and a, and a child jumping rope here. And these were just examples, but there would be six or seven of these silhouettes painted on the mural. And the artist will be painting these himself. And oh. they'll, they will be silhouettes of people who live in the neighborhood, and then inside of them is painted an architectural element from the neighborhood or from the city, from, you know, something historic in the neighborhood or in the city at large. For example, the, the male figure here, inside of his silhouette is a detailed painting of the Burbank chair a carriage house and the little girl that's on this side inside of her silhouette is a detailed painting of the trout sculpture that is uh, um, in the Prince Memorial Greenway Park 